try it again. I was told that life is cheap in Portugal, that everything is better. The sky is more blue, the grass is more green, and all the YouTubers all say great things about Portugal. I haven't heard one singular bad thing, and I'm not gonna say anything bad unless it deserves it. I have about 15 euros. My challenge is to see whether 15 euros covers one basic meal, something on the side, a drink, maybe some tea, and some dark chocolate to snack on. I show you my balance, and let's start the journey. So we're gonna get meat, because I'm not gonna eat the bugs. We're gonna get red meat, onions, maybe some stuff for salad. And we need tea, trash bag, maybe cheese. As I said, we already have olive oil, we have salt. I'm making Portugal's image better because I'm not gonna spend money on olive oil, which is like 10 euros. Let's get some red meat and no crickets. So this is the meat section. We have some seasoned meat. So chicken, but we're not a bunch of soy boys to have any dressing on top or any seasoning and that's five euros by the way like this might be enough for one and a half meals okay 457 it's for two patties now i tried these and they're not so good because they're very thin and when you cook them they become thinner it's 350 but it tastes like horse to be honest i'm thinking let's get minced meat right like minced meat with onions yeah if we can find some cool. so minced meat check it out i like this the most it has menos 30% Whatever that means We're getting close to the 15 limit already with just the meat But we're gonna get onions with the meat because we're not savages We're not gonna just eat minced meat It should cost around 2 euros 40 Right? I think it's 2.40 usually No idea Don't record in the supermarket These ones are more expensive Yeah, so whatever catches your eye Whatever catches your eye first is more expensive. Three euros thirty for six basic ass onions. Instead, because we're brokies, because we're brokies, we get these ones. How much is this? There, right it's there. Brokey onions, one euro fifty. Four euros seventy-five. Oh, that's a lot, eh? Where are these tomatoes originating from? Okay, we're gonna get these cherry tomatoes. Cucumbers? Angorakia. Can you see me as well? Perfect. Do we need like two, three? One. One? It's huge. This is huge to you? <laughs> get it the wrong way. <laughs> Whoever designed this is an absolute dickhead. <laughs> We go. I think it's going to be over 15 years already. No, but we're in Portugal. Everything is cheaper. It's the place to be. But a small one, so we don't go. We're not trying to go over 15 euros. What? Wait, this is lettuce, right? Like that. Corchayo. Corchayo is lettuce. No idea. You don't even know what, if this is lettuce. It's lettuce. No, it's not lettuce. I don't know how to name it. In Russian, kapusta. Kapusta. It's kapusta. I don't have to speak Russian to understand what lettuce is. This looks like lettuce. Looks more like lettuce, but still no one. Lombra. And a salad is not a salad without feta. I don't care what you Italians say, because your salad sucks. Look, no offense to Italians, but you guys can't make any salads, and I always need to have feta in my salad. So we're gonna get feta, and it might be a bit more expensive because it's imported. So we'll see. Guys, do you see her anywhere? Where did she go? She said she was getting tea like 10 minutes ago. Nice tea. Is there any tea there? I don't think they have feta here actually, not in this supermarket, even though it's super big. So yeah, let's just skip feta. We have yogurt anyways. Holy shit, they're expensive here, eh? 330? Three bro, in in Cyprus, in Greece, you can find for one year 80, really good quality. I'm getting the cheapest because I care about Portugal's reputation. Three euros, 29 cents, and I think it's 200 grams, right? I'm being realistic here. I'm getting just a small portion of yogurt, one euro 60. So basically what I'm saying here is that I want to get a snack with my meal. And again, I'm trying to get the ingredients for the meal for 15 euros. And here I select 85% healthy dark chocolate. Is this over here? It's two euros eighty nine. 
Also got some mayonnaise because we ran out of the mayonnaise. I'm doing Sober October, inspired by Zorro Juan, starting earlier. But I have to say the Portuguese wine is pretty cheap. It's cheaper than Greece, cheaper than Cyprus. You can find like a decent wine for three, four euros. You can show them for 25. This is like red wine. I think mostly dry. As you can see, they have a lot of wine here. And we just didn't show you the cheapest section, but you can find that. We didn't end up buying wine in the end, but I just wanted to highlight some good stuff about Portugal. I mean, we separated now. Whatever is hypothetically supposed to fit in 15 years, ah, we minus this one. Yeah, minus and this piece. whatever else. No, I told them I'll get one trash bag. So. Okay. I'm guessing it's gonna be like 18. I'm, I might not have enough. I'm guessing it's gonna be like 18 euros. I might not have enough in the resolution. It's a big, big commercial. Okay, I have to stay with this. Five cards? Five card, yeah. Okay. No? Sure. Mm -hmm. Okay. So basically it was a little above 25 euros and I know the comments are gonna be like, oh well you bought a trash bag, you bought mayonnaise, you bought dark chocolate. Well even if you remove those products it would be like 20 euros still and that's a lot for one meal. And I won't eat the entire dark chocolate bar. Remove another two, that's 18 euros, which is still way more than 15 euros. I didn't pass the test. It's official. McDonald's is cheaper. Should we eat McDonald's every day? Is that what the New World Order wants us to do? Alright guys, I'm gonna end the video over here. Give it a like if you're not gonna move to Portugal. Subscribe for more content and I'll see you in the next one.